I am a huge Twilight freak. I think I might be the oldest one out there. I'm not exactly sure, but I loved all the books. I read them in less than a week, and uh, I've seen all the movies, obviously. And just, you know, I actually have read the whole series, I think, three or four times before. I'm Cherise Frugé, and I'm the program director for Sophie at 1037 in San Diego. And we are here at Petco Park at the park. And we are doing our Lunar Eclipse event. And basically what that is is a double showing tonight of the first two installments of Twilight. Okay, well, we're out front uh, at Petco Park at the park. Obviously, the line of people waiting to get in so that they can be a part of our big uh, lunar eclipse here. I, I don't necessarily think I have to ask uh, which team that you guys are on. We love the vampires. Nobody a Taylor Lautner fan here? <laughs> are you guys all together? Okay, how long have you been uh, standing in line to get in? Since about 10.30 last night. And what's your favorite part uh, of the entire uh, series? Uh, the series, I just love the movies and the action, how the story plays out. So. Did you tell me that, did you guys say you've been sitting in line since when? Since 10.30 last night. <laughs> okay, so what did you do to sleep? Like, how did you guys sleep? We slept on concrete we slept, we, yeah. slept, so we slept on the concrete on blankets and we froze to death. <laughs> Let me ask you this, were you kind of forced to be out here with the girls or are you a huge fan too? I'm a huge fan. And uh, obviously a fan of... Alice. Uh -huh. Tell me what you love about Alice. Um, she's a really nice vampire. She doesn't like to hurt anyone. And, like, uh... Do you want to grow up and meet somebody like Alice? <laughs> All right. Well, you guys have a good time, and um, congratulations on being first in line. <laughs> Obviously, Taylor Lautner fans, Team Jacob. You like the Volturi? Okay, talk to me about that. That's a little weird. Talk to me about the, the Volturi. How can you? How is it? Like how they set the rules. You know, they they're the rulers, and you got to abide by their laws. So you're into authority figures, basically, is what. I love that. It's awesome. Yeah. yeah. Excellent. All right. Well, um, tell me what your favorite part of the movie is. Uh, obviously, with uh, New Moon, it was a big part of where the Volturi came into play. Talk to me about your favorite part of that. I like. Yes, definitely. I like the last part because. It shows um, Jane, her powers, and how she makes, um, how she tortures pretty much Edward <laughs> with her mind powers. It's awesome. I love it. Uh, so you like them when people torture Edward because you're yeah. Team Jacob fan. Yeah. <laughs> Team Edward! Team Jacob! <laughs> We're in front of Petco Park at the park walking down the line. People have been here since 10.30 last night. And these guys are very, very excited. We're about five minutes away from letting everybody into the park to watch the two movies. <laughs> the spirits are awesome out here. Everybody's excited. Team Jacob! Team Edward! And, uh... As soon as we get down to the end of the line here, we're going to go back inside and start talking to some of the characters on the show. Dr. Carlisle's gonna be here. We have Angela Bella's best friend who's gonna be here. Edward! 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 Team Edward! Edward! I'm Team Edward, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Team Edward or Jacob? Team Carlisle! Oh, we have a new one! <laughs> we have a new one, Team Carlisle! <laughs> starting to get out of breath here. Can we turn around back uh, and go back inside so we can start talking to some of uh, the characters on the red carpet? Oh my god, we're here at the red carpet and it's so crazy. Look at this crowd. Everybody say hello. Hello. Hi. Dr. Carlisle Cullen is coming up. Since the phenomenon, how has that changed your life? I would never be able to do this. I would never have the opportunity to hear this and feel the excitement and the warmth. And what's the craziest thing that's happened to you since all of this blew up? These situations are pretty crazy. Um, but they're like an exciting crazy. You're a little overwhelmed, but it's fun. Now, you're playing kind of a nerdy character in the movie, and you're such a beautiful woman. How do you feel about that role? I love her. Reading the books, I never really thought of Angela as nerdy. I always just thought she was this sweet, timid girl. So it was really fun to get to play one of my favorite characters from the book. Now, if you weren't casted in the movie, who would you want to get the girl? I don't know. See, before I officially started filming, I read the books after meeting with Catherine Hardwick, and at that point, I still I couldn't choose. Like, so it has nothing to do with me being involved in it. I feel like there are a lot of people out there who are on a neutral 
team and they can't decide who's better for her because it, she's not choosing between the good guy and the bad guy. She's choosing between two great guys. So, and What's your favorite story as far as filming on the set goes? As in like a behind the scenes story? I don't know. I, I think it's just like when we all get back together, we finish one movie and we're starting on the next, we're all back together again. That's what's really fun. Uh, Dr. Carlisle Cullen is right here. We're about to talk to him. This is crazy exciting. This is hard. I'm a fan. I'm nervous. <laughs> Let me get the, the, this is the crowd, I'm going to super crowd. Right. Oh my god, I'm kind of a little nervous to do this because I'm a huge fan, oh, um, so forgive me, I'm going to ask you uh, as many great questions as I possibly can, but this is obviously blown up and it's so huge, how has it changed you as a person? I don't know if it's changed me uh, as a person much, but it's definitely made me more, you know, appreciative of the fans that are out here and, uh, you know, I, I've gotten a lot busier. <laughs> What's the craziest thing that's happened to you since uh, since the bliss? I had a fan uh, that I asked her to sign her arm, and then she came back an hour later and had my name tattooed on her wrist. Wow. So an hour? Crazy, yeah. Now, they have all these great products out, the action figures and all that stuff. What's the craziest thing that you've seen come out of all of this? Um... I think Rob's face is on some underwear or something. I, don't, I, 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 didn't, I didn't get those. I'm not wearing those now. So. And what's your favorite part of the whole saga, the story? Uh, Clips is my favorite book. Uh, it feels like this, this movie has the most going on. Everything kind of comes to a head in this movie. Uh, Twilight kind of introduces you to the, to the vampires. New Moon introduces you to the werewolves. And then, uh, thank you. And then um, this movie kind of combines, you know, those two uh, teams are teaming up for, uh, for a huge big app, uh, battle, battle. so it uh, makes it pretty exciting. What does your wife think of the whole uh, Twilight Saga and the phenomenon? Uh, she loves it. I mean, uh, she's a fan of the books, and, and it's exciting for her to, you know, now just kind of take a back seat and let me do my thing, and, and she wants to retire. So. Is she Team Edward or Team Jacob? She's Team Edward. Woohoo! So am I. The, uh, the, family. <laughs> the fans are crazy. I'm shaking. I am so nervous. This is so amazing. We're at Petco Park at the park. Dr. Carlisle Cullen is here, and I can't even speak. <laughs>